Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the third annual Lighting of the Snowflakes on Market Street. I'm Spencer Christian from ABC 7 News, your MC for the evening. Welcome. <laughs> Joining us tonight also for this special event are the Dancing Snowflakes. They're from the San Francisco Ballet School. Here they come now, preparing for the Nutcracker performances, which begin on December 9th and continue through December 27th. And by the way, here's a little historical note. The first American city to premiere the Nutcracker was San Francisco, December 24th, 1944. How about that? We said a little history there. And we've still got the Nutcracker ongoing. All right. Snowflakes are here. The living snowflakes, as well as the other snowflakes. We're ready to begin our event. <laughs> First, I'd like to introduce to you one of the leaders of the team that makes this event possible. He is Ed Riskin, Director of Public of the Department of Public Works. Ed, come on up. Thank you, Spencer. Welcome, everyone, to the third annual Market Street Holiday Light Celebration. Let's hear it from Market Street. All right, thank you very much. We were out here in the Department of Public Works a few weeks ago. There was a little parade. A few people came out. Uh, we were here batting cleanup, or actually doing cleanup. Um, and here we are back at Market Street. Market Street is really the heart of San Francisco, and we're really delighted to be a part of the holiday lighting ceremony and festivities. Three years ago, when the mayor appointed me to this position, one of the first things he said is, I want holiday lights on Market Street this year. So that year, we got 94 lights up working with our partners at the San Francisco Public Utilities Commission, which is the, manages the city's municipal power department. The mayor said, that's great, but that's not enough. So the next year, we got 116 lights up. Yes. And the mayor said, that's great, but that's still not enough. So this year, we've got 142 lights up lining our beautiful Market Street. So I, I do want to, this, this is a partnership that makes this happen. Uh, the woman who's behind it all, who gets everybody moving to make this happen, is the, the great, highly energetic head of the Market Street Association, Carolyn Diamond. Let's give her a hand. I also want to thank our partners at the PUC, General Manager Ed Harrington, Barbara Hale and Sue Black, as well as my staff, Muhammad Nuru and Matt Smith. Those are the team of folks who work together to make this happen. I want to acknowledge the sponsors. If you look up at the banners above, you'll see names of some of the corporations that are contributing to making this happen, to bring in life to the holiday time at Market Street. I want to thank them, and I want to encourage you all to come to Market Street, to come to the area of all around downtown San Francisco, all around San Francisco for the holidays. Spend your time, spend your money. Happy holidays, everyone. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. Well. You know, there are many things about the holiday season that make it special, and of course, you can't ignore shopping, a big part of the season. So here's a man who has some news about some great shopping deals for the holidays. He is Matt Steiker, Chief Marketing Officer for the San Francisco Convention and Visitors Bureau. Hi. Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm actually going to let uh, the Honorable Mayor talk a little bit about our Shop SF program and how exciting... No! The... The thing for me is, I, I talked to some folks in the crowd before I came up tonight and just said, what are some of the things that really signal the holidays for you about San Francisco? And it's everything from the trees that are being lit all over town to the wreath across the street at Westfield to the sounds like uh, the Salvation Army bells and the cable car bells. And for our snowflakes, of course, it's the sound of the Nutcracker again and again and again that they have to hear. We hope you'll have a chance to come out and see the Nutcracker. But the thing that I want to point out is that this is a city that is so wonderfully diverse in all of the things that you can do around San Francisco. It's one of the things that attracts so many visitors to San Francisco, and it's one of the things that helps keep our lives uh, the quality of our lives so vital and so wonderful. All of these tourists help actually make our life better because they support the stores, the shops, the restaurants, the galleries, everything that you guys do and take advantage of on a daily basis is helped by the visitor industry. And we're so excited to be a part of it. We're so excited to be part of, sorry Spencer. It's okay. It's the ABC <laughs> mic too, that's so embarrassing. 
And we're so excited to be part of the Market Street Lighting, and we're so glad that you all came out tonight. Thank you so much, and thanks again to Carolyn Diamond and our Snowflakes for being here. Okay, Matt. Now, as you can imagine, for our special events like the Lighting of the Snowflakes here and other projects around the city, it takes a lot of teamwork. And the next person I'm bringing up here is the man who oversees all these teams. He is the mayor of the great city of San Francisco and the next lieutenant governor of the great state of California, Gavin Newsom. Thank you, Spencer. We're live here, Channel 7, sorry. Thank you, Spencer, and thank you, Channel 7, obviously and always uh, for being out here the last three years. To the poor snowflakes that are always freezing cold, every year I say, I, you got to warm up, but I'm incredibly grateful because you're so gracious uh, to be out here and, uh, and to make this more festive to our great band. Yeah. Big round of applause. Great job. We are grateful. To Mohammed Nehru and to Ed Reeskin and the team at DPW for their great work. To Carolyn Diamond. Uh, and to all of you that have no idea why you're here, but you saw a mic and some lights and you're looking to be entertained. Uh, I am grateful that you took the time. I don't know that I'm going to entertain you, but I am here to thank you. Uh, thank you for coming out here. Thank you for supporting our city. Thank you for supporting the merchants out here. Thank you for making the holidays that much more special because you are here and you are energetic and you are enthusiastic about this city, your life, the incredible diversity of offerings that makes up this wacky and wonderful place we call home, San Francisco. I, uh, I, I think San Francisco was best described by someone when they described it as 47 and a half square miles surrounded by reality which is a wonderful way to describe a city of dreamers, a city of doers, a city of entrepreneurs, a city of innovators, but a city that has always prided itself on being on the leading and cutting edge. Most of the time, we get it right. Sometimes, we just challenge the norms and we learn from our mistakes. But San Francisco has always prided itself on challenging the status quo. And one of the things that marks our great success is our remarkable diversity. Here you are in San Francisco. This is important for all the visitors, not just the people who live here. You're in one of the most diverse cities, in one of the most diverse states, in the world's most diverse democracy, America. And I can say this proudly, by and large, people are living together, advancing together, and prospering together across every conceivable and imaginable difference. What we love about our city is we don't tolerate our diversity, we celebrate it. And we celebrate it with the cultural competency of our diverse neighborhoods. And we celebrate it here, today, in the kickoff of our holiday season, in Union Square, at the foot of our Pal Street cable car turnaround with those cable car sounds that mark what makes San Francisco such a memorable place and a memorable experience. So let me end, because you are getting cold out there, by welcoming you down to Market Street. And my job is to encourage you back to enjoy the sounds of the F-Line, the historic streetcar that's going by, to enjoy the sounds of the cable car bells, to enjoy the sounds of your friends and neighbors as they celebrate a remarkable shopping experience by experiencing the discounts they can enjoy by our very own Shop SF program, where you can go online to the Convention and Visitors Bureau site and learn about how you can take advantage of parking discounts, take advantage of discounts in participating restaurants and bars, and to the 200 plus retail merchants that will provide you discounts if you are from the San Francisco Bay Area because we want to take care of you as well. Staycations in our city. Enjoy a vacation, not overseas, but in our own city and county of San Francisco. That was what they paid me to say. So I needed to get that out. That was the, that was the personal contract that I had. 
Thank you to all the participating sponsors, to Westfield and all the folks that uh, are paying for these lights that we are going to count down together to turn on. That's why you were really here. So can I get a 10? I didn't hear it. A nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. They're up. Unbelievable. Thank you, everybody. Happy holidays. Thank you, Spencer. Thank you all for coming. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Mayor Gavin Newsom. Thank you, everybody. Matt, Ed, Carolyn, Dancing Snowflakes, the band, everybody who came out tonight. Happy holidays.